Hey what's up guys today i got something pretty cool something that is really useful for people who are getting started with arduino here i want to show you a complete easy to use plug and play arduino beginners kit from seed studio the best thing about this kit is it contains almost all the sensors and modules prepared so that you don't need to use any breadboard or connection wires or solder them to make it work simply connect the board to the computer and start playing Guys this video series is an Arduino course for beginners you will learn everything you need to know about Arduino so if you want to learn more hit the subscribe button this kit was very kindly provided to us by Seed Studio they provide electronic products and services for makers to engineers they have an active part in fusion pcb manufacture pcb assembly cnc milling services and more so thank you guys very much for sending this out to us Now let's see what's in the box. Guys, this is the most complete starter kit for Arduino. There is a ton of stuff in there, but don't worry guys, we are going to take a look at each and every one of them. Guys, first I just want to show you the Arduino Uno compatible Arduino board. And yes guys it is just like coding an Arduino Uno board which is the most beginner friendly board from Arduino. This is the heart of everything on this board. In fact, this is the one which controls the whole board. Then we have 10 most commonly used sensors and modules which will help you kick start your robotics instinct. On the left side we have LED, buzzer, LED display, button and rotary potentiometer. And on the right side we have sound sensor, light sensor, temperature and humidity sensor air pressure sensor and three axis accelerometer all these sensors are prewired and connected to gpio pins of the arduino so you don't have to use breadboard or jumper wires along with the package you will also get six connecting wires as well as a mini usb cable which you can use to program the board if you look at the board you will also see some useful information like common references that you will come across when you start coding The advantage of this kit is you can do so many things with this board itself without any modification. You can try out various modules together like uh, beeping the buzzer when you press this button or turning on LED if the ambient light is low and things like that. All these are very basic you will need to get started with an Arduino and can be done in an easy and fun way. No messy wires and soldering. You will find the complete pin mapping in the description below. Guys, if you find this video useful, consider supporting my channel by giving this video a like. and subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscribe button below i would really appreciate it so let's get started with the first code all you need to get started is arduino ide which is as you know free of cost you can download the latest version of arduino ide from here now you can connect the board of the pc using micro usb cable most of the time in windows 10 pc you won't have to do anything else it will automatically detect the board as arduino you know If the driver is not installed or if the driver is installed incorrectly it will appear as unknown device in the device manager at this point the driver should be manually installed i will share the link to the usb driver and instructions in the link below now we will start coding let's start with the classic hello world simply copy the code below and paste it in arduino ide basically what this code do is it will print hello world every 1 second here if you look closely The code has two functions: void setup and void loop. Setup function is used to initialize variables, pin modes, or libraries. The setup function will run only once after each power up or reset of Arduino board. In our case, it will initialize the serial port of Arduino and facilitates the transfer of data between the USB port and Arduino board. The loop function exactly does what its name suggests, and it loops infinitely, allowing your program to do something. change and respond to sensor inputs we can use it to actively control the arduino board so in our code when the board is powered up first setup function is executed which will initialize the serial port and the loop function which will print hello world every 1 second now let us upload click on tools boards and select arduino genuino you know as board click tools boards and select the right port Now press the verify button to compile. After the compilation is successful, press the upload button. Once the upload is complete, open serial monitor. 
you can see hello world being printed on a new line every 1 second. Congrats guys, you have run the first code on your Groove Beginner Kit for Arduino. In the next video, we will start working with other sensors. So hit the subscribe button below if you want to learn more about Arduino. So stay tuned guys.